Hey guys, this is my fifth video here. Uh, this time I'll be telling you about uh, Chainfire 3D uh, GPU emulator app. Uh, it's awesome. It makes uh, mobile like Motorola Defy play really awesome games. Tegra based, Qualcomm processor based, 9M 3D, Riptide GP, etc. and etc. etc. Uh, it's very easy to uh, install it. I'll just tell you. Just uh, you. It's in the market, the free version and pro version. Download and install it. You'll get it like this. I'm using the free version here. Here it is. Uh, you get this option of uh, install Chainfire 3D driver. Click install. One thing you need to know that uh, you get a warning. Uh, sometimes boot loops may happen. Sometimes screen won't wake up. So you better have a Android backup of this ROM uh, at hand. So that if anything goes wrong, your phone will uh, come back to life. You click install. Uh, yeah, one more thing. You get basically two options: install normal installation, and second is install via Clockwork Bot Recovery. This is real advanced. It's like flashing this app into this ROM, uh, but still I prefer the first one. Uh, press install, and let it do. It will install the app and automatically reboot the phone. If it doesn't boot or if it uh, boots and uh, the if if it starts having uh, reboots. Uh, or boot loops or whatever uh, you can uh, always uh, restore your old previous Android backup and if you don't know how to make a backup or restore I have made a video in my in my account you can uh, have a view motor logo is there good green LED is there good blue LED has gone good okay now let's see if the boot animation comes and yes the boot animation is also there okay now it seems the phone will start so when it starts this is just the first part of installation second part is installing the drivers of this app uh, there are basically three drivers Qualcomm, PowerVX and Tegra based uh, since device uh, Power VX VX, so I don't require Power VR driver. I will install Qualcomm and Tegra based. The very small size drivers uh, will be installed by Chainfire 3D only. Very simple process. Uh, let it boot, I'll just show you. And here it is, it is booted. Uh, yep. So it'll take some time loading it. Anyway, I'll try and open it. It is there. Okay, it's open. Checking super user settings and all. Okay, this is it. So now we get this. Uh, driver is installed. We get the default Opal GA settings. This is the option install plugins and shaders. You click this, this app will automatically scan the complete SD card for the drivers and when it will get it, it will automatically install them. Here it is uh, searching. Generally, does it a little faster, uh, but since I opened this app while the phone was even loading, perhaps that's why it's taking much time. Okay, it's got it. So, I basically have two zips here uh, or two drivers Qualcomm and NVIDIA. Uh, to install them, okay, I was wrong. Uh, they don't automatically get installed just uh, press it and then they get automatically installed you need to press them Qualcomm installed NVIDIA installed so this is it you have the two drivers here now you can actually play Tegra games in uh, PowerVR GPU in Motorola Defy, Reptite GPN all as I said earlier 
pretty awesome app i hope i helped you people uh, this will be it thank you very much if you have any doubts i have a linked xg account and the comments of course so do let me know thank you very much